I'm going to quickly go over how you email uh, from RunWeb. So over here where you have your normal tabs for gradebook attendance, that sort of stuff, if you go down to email and select email, you could email progress reports out to parents or students, or if you want to send a message, say a message to the staff, once you click on message, um, so then if you do your school staff, if you want to email just a couple people, you could select one or more people and click this arrow here and then they show up. Now you'll notice no names show up in the to box down here until you go down and select staff that you want to email those staff members. If you want to email all the staff members, you could click this double arrow here and now you have an email that goes out to all the staff members. If you want to include an attachment, you select add down here by attachment. So you have a class list for people going on a field trip. And select browse, go to where you have your file, and yeah, wherever you'd have your file, and select it. Okay, I want to send out my chapter review answers. And then hit open, and that'll add that as an attachment. Uh, if you want to type a message, you go back up here to the compose send button, and you can type in the subject such as field trip Friday the 26th um, and then talk about I'm taking my class here you could type in your message once you hit send then it'll go out to all the people that you have in this two box here the same thing works if you want to email a class so to get rid of these names you press the double arrow here and it takes all the names out but the same thing would work say you want to email your class so you have a first hour algebra class uh, something happens with the assignment you forget to pass out a paper you could kick all their names over in there and add the paper as an attachment. Um, now you'll notice no names have shown up in this to section. I need to uncheck staff and then click on the student. Now it'll go to all the student addresses, which is why there's all S's on there. Again, go to compose send to type up the message that you want to send with a subject. If you want to email the students and the parents, now that you have the class selected, you also could put down custody. And that would go to the students and their parents should all show up in there. Or if you want to email just the parents, then you'd unclick the students. And just the custody, whoever has custody for the students, would get the email. Um, so lots of different options. But it's really easy and fast to send emails through RenWeb. Um, you also could do it through your school email account if you wanted to. Uh, but RenWeb is especially suited for doing it.